Yeah. Right. Hi there. Hi everyone. I am outside an old historic place. Oh, look at this guy ruining my video. This guy. Hey, too much noise. <laughs> I'm back. I'm back. Outside Casa Gorordo. So I'm doing a, a little walk today just to show you the remains of some of the Spanish you know buildings at the time of the colonization and as you can see here Mark Siniza yeah so this is what left it has a very very good history this place don't want to make it too long don't want to bore you guys but just just a quick intro information until we get to the next next place San Diego This is also This yes the Spanish an old structure as you can see this was built during the Spanish era and see? this was built around here. See this is this is wonderful isn't and it look at those Again you know you can't make a video inside so you can those only take a still pictures The Parol Ah, the parole, yeah, very, very Filipino, yeah. And then, the Yap San Diego Heritage House, oh, there you go. These are some of the details. And this one is oh my also God. another old yeah. structure. Look, 1931. 1931, this used And this is the Art Diocesan Museum of Cebu. Along, we, you can't film inside again, guys, apologies. And, and this is the cathedral. You can see. It's very well preserved. This is in Filipino. This was built First is a cafe. Cathedral of Cebu. Santonini's church. This is Santonini's church. We have to be careful crossing. Thank you for So yes, Santonini Church which was damaged in an earthquake I don't know how many years ago and it was restored by the same piece I don't know if you can see the uh, the broken blocks but they really restored it Antonini and now guys I know I'm skipping a bit of history but this is Magellan Cross which I will take you to Lapu Lapu basically this is the Portuguese explorer when he first come to Cebu coming with the cross and he and Lapu Lapu killed him the queen of that time this is the cross that he brought with him that's the story of it Look at this <laughs> April the 12th, April the 21st, 1521. And I will take you to the Heritage Square where it will summarize the whole history. Okay? So, yeah, as you know, Cebu was colonized by the Spanish. And then during the Second World War was occupied by the Japanese for over three years. Hello. For over three years. So in the war in 1945, most of the city was destroyed. So that's why, you know, I shown you in this video the old house there. You know, but this is what some of the houses that remain. Everything else you see is very modern. Wow.
Wow, that's awesome, guys. Wow. So as you can see, guys, this is a summary of everything you see in Zidu. You can see Santorini. This is how Christianity started. Oh, yeah, this is the famous church, yes. yes. What's it called? Santo Nino. Santa Nino church, yes. And then from here, you can also see Lapu Lapu. Here, Lapu Lapu is here. That one. That, that one. Which I will make a video from Mactan Lapu Lapu actually. <laughs> So this is this is north of the city, right? Yeah, we would say north. a little bit north, 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 northwest of the city. I would say, wow. Northeast, east. Apologies, northeast of the city. Okay, guys, I hope you like this video, and hope this summarizes everything. And until the next one, see yeah. you.